Hello everybody, my name is Alpha Nephilim. Welcome back to Let's Play Dust. Okay, we're on our way to a series of volcanoes where the Moonbloods are. And this will most likely end up in a final battle against Gaius and his army. I don't know about you guys, but I'm looking forward to it. This asshole has had it coming. Oh, look at that. Okay, let me actually save my game. Ow! Why did I do that? Halt! Who goes? Oh, it's you. Apologies, Miss Robin. Please, enter. Okay. Welcome your presence, Sen Mithrarin. Preparations for war are nearly complete. Surely you have more soldiers than this. General Gaius is nothing if not thorough. His forces have exterminated most Moonbloods from this land. We are all that's left. How do you expect to win with so few soldiers? We cannot. That's why we created Sen Mithrarin. You dust will turn the tide. Ah, uh, well. No pressure or anything. Yeah, yeah, no pressure. Does General Gaius know of this place? I fear he does now. What? How? One of our own has been keeping an eye on you since your travels began. A merchant, Sereth. Aha! I knew that creepy merchant was one of you guys. Duh. How did a Moonblood operate so freely in the Wildlands? He is a smart businessman. Deals in all the right places. Gaius' soldiers turn their gaze from him in exchange for free goods. However, no amount of bribery could cover up that Sereth was helping you to find us. Oh no. And that's how Gaius found out. How much time do you think we have to prepare? I hope he's okay. Not long, I'm afraid. The whole purpose of Gaius' campaign is to wipe us from the face of this world. Once he knows of our final stronghold, he will send everything he has and destroy us. I see Why? Why does he hate Moonblood so much? No fire. Is this the way of the flameless light? It is, yes. In ancient times, the Moonbloods went by another name. We lived in a great society called the Sintak, and we wielded the knowledge to follow the way of the flameless light. Settle in dust. This could take a while. We Sintak harnessed a power unlike any this world had ever seen. We built elaborate contraptions like these lamps. Capable of piercing the darkness without so much as a spark. Well, obviously something went wrong because we still have to build a fire every time Dust pulls out his map. Unfortunately, the ancient tomes do not say how the Sintuk fell, and that knowledge has been lost. Perhaps intentionally. All we know is that our kind were made as outcasts, and that has remained true for countless generations. For the longest time, we believe the Moonbloods were the only ones left who know of the way of the flameless light. But we were wrong. Oh boy. When General Gaius began his purge, there were stories of their weapons. Stories of elaborate contraptions that seemed to defy the natural world. Weapons that sound identical to those of the Sinduk in the most ancient of tales. Okay, so he's got super weapons. What are we talking about? Arrows made of light. Machines that take to the sky like birds. Really? And we are supposed to fight these things with your lamps. I did not say it would be easy. Nobody ever does. I did once, remember? Yeah, and you were wrong. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm here now. Is there anything I can do to help? We are spread rather thin. Our chief engineer, Sonjin, is having trouble with our camp support systems. Go and speak with him when you can, and I'm sure he will explain further. There is also the matter of our scout, Kier. He is not checked in for many hours. But with our battle preparations, we have not been able to mobilize a proper search party. His patrol takes him east of our camp if you aim to find him. 
Ginger. Ginger? Gin? Oh, dust. It's you. Yeah, just me. Are you alright? I'll be fine. Just a lot to think about. Listen, about Jin. Yes? What was he like? He was very kind. Almost to a fault, really. I like him already. <laughs> yes, he had that effect on people. I like to believe it's what made you do all those wonderful things for Aurora and Mudpot. Aro was always testing me. Every time I made a choice, he would tell me if it was the right one. I was choosing whether to follow Jin or Cassius. I believe they were both trying to influence my actions. And you listened to Jin? Yeah, he's kinda hard to ignore. He is, isn't he? Or at least he was. No, Ginger, I think you were right the first time. I think Jin continues to live through my actions. He's guiding me, keeping me on the right path. But what of your other half? Cassius murdered my family, Dust. He destroyed my village, killed my friends. How can you control such a terrible being? I feel his presence every time I swing the blade of Ara. I believe the Elder was right. Without him, I'd have been cut down long ago. But Jin... Jin keeps him from taking control. That's good. As long as Cassius lives within you, though, there's always that danger. You could always be pulled to a path of evil. I won't lie. I felt him pulling me to take the quick and easy path. To leave the weak to fend for themselves. To show no mercy to those in my way. Perhaps someday you can be rid of his foul presence. Maybe. Someday. For now, I need him to defeat Gaius. There's no other way. I know. Still, I'm glad we were able to talk, Dust. Me too, Ginger. I'll be back before you know it. Be careful. So... Does he still kind of count as her brother? Ah, you've arrived just in time, Mithrarin. My name is Sanjin. I'm what you'd call a chief engineer, I suppose the term is. The Elder mentioned you needed some help? Yes, indeed. In the caverns below, we've set up machinery to provide the camp with power and water. Unfortunately, seismic activity has shut down both systems, so we need to get them running once more. Alright. I have been rather preoccupied handling the battle preparations, so if you could, I would appreciate it if you went down there to examine the generators. Sure, Sanjin. I'll take a look. Thank you. You'll need to restart the generator and water pump when you're down there. We'll require both systems to be running if we're going to stand a chance against General Gaius. Alright, let's see what I got to do. Okay. Rip, rip. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, level up. Get over here. Okay, slap down my defense. Ah! No! Give me a no! 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 Oh, that is not good. That was not my finest moment. Awesome lava effect, though. At least it was an instant death. Nice try. Ok, 
Okay, then it's the generator. Well, this is the water pump. Or huh. pump. No wonder it stopped. These vines are growing all over it. I don't want to risk damaging the pump trying to cut those vines. Maybe there's some way we can burn them off? Hmm. Oh, no, 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 no! There we go, now it actually lets me do it. Alright, that seems to fix it. Nice work, Fidget. Ah, stop. You're making me blush. Oh, please, please. I want to see that. I want to see Fidget blush. She's just too adorable. I can't take it. Da 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 whoop Rip a doo whoop a doo Okay Eh no Nope I don't think so Yep Fancy jumping Come on come on Oh. La 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 Hey Okay, lava falls Yeah Stick out. Woo! That was a short platform. Okay, I'm gonna need lightning here. Well, there's the generator. Let's see if we can find a way to get it working again. I sense no energy emanating from the device dust. Perhaps there is a way to return its spark? There we go. Probably still be wandering around in the mountains outside of Rome. Wait, what? <laughs> what I meant to say was, uh, <laughs> don't worry about it. Okay, that's the generator and the water pump back online. Let's return to Sanji. Awesome. <laughs> Wee! Yeah. Ah, no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Give me back up! 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 Whoop! Press elevator. Excellent work, Miss Rarin. Now that the power and water systems are working again, we can hold our ground against Gaius' soldiers. You have saved many lives this day. Good to know. Wait, is there anything else? Excellent. Oh no, that's lead that flag is on the other area. I need to go this way. Oh, no, wait, 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 that's gonna lead out for the encampment. And you go talk to the Elder. There you are. Mithrarin, do you need anything else? Thank you, Elder. Or Moonblood Warriors. Ginger? 
Yes? Are you all right? I'll be fine. Just a lot to think about. I'm sorry. There's still... Yes. You too. Seriously, do they still count as brother and sister? <laughs> I need to know this before I try to look up fan fiction. Hear what? Did I hear what? Uh oh, I felt a rumble. I'm feeling rumbles. I got plenty of these. Magma mantle. Wait. Ah, oh, I don't have the money. Ah. What the hell? Oh no. Just look. It's the missing sentry. What happened here? Just ah, look out. Uh oh. else? Anyone else want to go? Jeez. Could already be in the camp. Kier, but he was ambushed by Gaius' soldiers. He didn't stand a chance. Then it has already begun. Dust, we are nearly out of time. Please, help Sonjin get our camp support systems working once again. Without them, we will stand little chance of mounting an effective defense. It sounds like Sanjin was able to get the pumps and generators working again. Sanjin? No doubt thanks to your help. 
With power and water flowing through our camp once again, we will be better equipped to handle our enemies in battle and properly tend to our wounded. Thank you, Dust. I believe we are as prepared as we possibly could be. With the enemy at our gates, we have no choice but to begin our assault. Our warriors are gathering at the edge of the camp, waiting for you to lead them. Take this yellow resonance gem, Dust. Use it to open the gate. Thank you, Elder. I will do that. Whatever happens, right, I do something else. Thrarin, know that I am honored to have stood before you. The Moonbloods will follow you unto death. Now go, and Dust, good luck. Yeah, I kind of need to do something first. And once I do that something, then I'll call it quits for this episode. Okay, so I need to get... Okay, so I actually cannot go anywhere except for here. Well, I'm not going the way of the bloms. I need to get more money! I can't rack up a good combo against these guys. Even Fidget can annihilate these freaks. Come on. Why did I never try to parry these guys? One slash. Whoop. One slash. One slash. No slash. Whee! Open wide. Open wide. Now, goodbye, my friends. These guys don't even hurt anymore. They don't hurt anymore. Okay. Let's take over one more thing. Goodbye, bummy. Goodbye, bloms. Jumpy, jumpy. Zeppy, ow!
Eh, no. That is not what I wanted. Hey, buddy, don't lose your head. Okay, now to go in here. Now that I have all the resonance gems, we'll find out what's in here at last. This is really cool how that happens. Yellow. Wow. Okay, white. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me right now? Really? 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 See it now. I might have to make a special episode where I come back here with all the gems and show you what happens. Wait, do I have a. Yeah, I got teleportation crystals. Get me the hell out of here. Okay, so that was just a waste of time. Uh, buddy. Yeah, I'm, I'll probably do a special episode. I'm assuming I get the last one after this, but I'll do a special episode, if that's the case, where I open up all those gates. Anyway. Coming up on the final battle, people. I'm going to beat this game in one more video. So until then, I'm Alpha Nephilim, and I'll see you in the next video. Later!